feeling, audience? Are you guys ready to play Picture Rico? All right. I'm going to give you some info right now. You guys are playing for a Monterey Bay getaway. Fun stuff. The first challenge we're going to play is called Go Find Fish. Now, we score everything here with fish points because it's all about feeding fish to that very hungry penguin. I know it looks like he's on a diet, but it's not. He wants a lot of fish. In our audience, we've got green fish, we've got orange fish, we've got a ton of other stuff. Audience, let's see what you got. When I say go, you will run out to the audience and have 15 seconds to grab as many of your team's colored fish as possible. So ready, set, go find fish. Come on. Here we go. Lots of fish, a little bit of time. Four, three, two, one. Time is up. Green Team Orange Team, make your way down to the stage. So you guys get 10 fish points for every fish that you found. Green Team, according to our fish counter, you guys found 15 fish. It's 150 fish. The Green Team. Orange Team. You guys also found 15 fish. You've got 150 fish points. We've got an even tie right now. The four of us are going to take off and head over to Picture Rica's Maze Craze game. While we do that, here's a chance for you to get to know these guys, the Orange Team. Take a look. The Orange Team knows how to sh 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 shake it. Big sister Amanda is an award-winning dancer who also enjoys improv class. Her little sister Lainey loves dancing so much, she stars in her own silly little videos. Even Mom once busted a move on stage in the middle of the Lainey's dance competition. Awkward. You have to watch out for your mom. We dressed her up as one of our Picturica characters. This is what we dressed her up as. Susie Scissors! Bring out Mom! What do you think of mom? She looks um, colorful and amazing. Yeah. Yes. I love the scissors. Yes. I like the bow, too. It's very bright. It's very colorful. And we like that. That's going to work great for the Maze Craze Game. <laughs> Here's how it works. I'm going to show you a picture of a character. You will be running through that maze to try and find the character. Mom, you'll be doing all the running. You've got 60 seconds to find up to six characters out there in the maze. For every character that you find and return to the bin, we will give you 20 fish points. Now. Orange team, let's get ready for our maze craze game. All right, Mom, the first place you're going to go to is over there at Eskimo's Igloo. Head on over there. Good luck, Orange team. Ready, set, go find Hat Full of Ghosts. And 26 points. That is correct. Go find Spitting Man. Spitting Man. Looks just like that. Spitting Man. Amanda have spotted Spitting Man. Here he comes. Spitting Man for another 26 points. Point. That is correct. Go find Running Skull. Right there, Mom, right there, right there. On the phone. On the phone. Right there. Right there. Right there. Okay, Amanda, find a way. That is correct. Give me another 26 points. That is correct. Go find Skateboarding Dragon. Skateboarding Dragon. Oh, which way? Which way? Which way? Which way? Look at you guys go. Why not? We'll give you another 26 points. That is correct. Go find Snake Charmer. Where yeah. is Snake Charmer? Snake Charmer. Uh, look around, look around. Ten seconds. Mom, you found the snake charmer, but unfortunately, time was up. But come on down here, Orange Team. You guys did great. Come on down. You were able to find four out of the six characters. You guys are now in the lead with 230 fish points. And now here's a chance for you to kick back, relax, and get to know the Green Team. Roll it. Meet the Green Team, Dad's a drummer who also coaches little brother Johnny's baseball team. The two even participated in a giant water balloon fight with the entire team. <laughs> Big sister Lexi may have avoided getting smacked with balloons, but she did walk into a screen door in front of a crowd. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> That's funny. Let's see how funny your dad looks today. Take a look. We dressed him up as Oscar. <laughs> Let's bring out Dad. Check this out. You look awesome. What do you think of Dad? 
<laughs> you ready to play the Maze Craze game? I'm ready to go. You know how it works, right? You've got 60 seconds to find up to six characters. Every character that you find and return to the bin will earn you 20 fish points. If you head over to your starting position, which is over there at Eskimo's Igloo. Good luck, green team. 60 seconds on the clock. Dad, ready, set, go find Whale of a Tail. That is correct. Go fight like Snap Shooter. Snap Shooter. Straight, 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 straight. I'm going on the corner. I'm going on the corner. Snap Shooter, you get a picture of Snap Shooter. Correct. Go find Rhino with Cupcake. Rhino with Cupcake. Wow, Dad. Nice. Another 25th points. Go find Artie. Artie, 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 Help him out, audience. Hello. If you see Artie, looks like that. Looking for Artie. Where could Artie be? Where? Where is Artie? Where's Artie? Where is Artie? Oh, time is up, Dad. Come on out here, green team. You found three out of the six characters. You now have 210 fist points. In comes the orange team with 230 fist points. But we're just getting warmed up. When we come back, we are going to rock the blocks to go out of all happens next on Picture Rico. Picture Rica, the Find It Fast, Find It First show that families love to play. And these guys are having a great time right now. Our orange team is in the lead with 230 fish points. <laughs> Green team right behind them with 210 fish points. <laughs> and a little FYI for you guys, the team with the most fish points at the end of today's show will be playing for that grand prize. G, remind these guys what that grand prize is. Corey, today's winners will be playing for a trip to Monterey, Woo! That's good times. All right. Quick question. Quick question. Are you guys ready to rock? Yeah. All right. That means it is time to rock the block. Awesome. Here's how it works. I'm going to give you the name of an item that you need to find. When I say go, you will knock down your walls of blocks. Then one player from each team will dive into that block field looking for that item. When you find it, grab that block, run up the step, and place it right there in front of the step with the item facing forward. After you've done that, tag the next player who will then go looking for the next item. Every correct block that you place on the step will earn you 40 fish points. Once you've placed all five blocks, your job is not done. You see, you've got to race to the top of the steps, grab that finish line flag, hold it high, wave it proud, and scream, Picturica! We will give you an additional 25 bonus fish points, and you will be the winner of this round. Yeah! So, are we ready to knock over some blocks? Yeah! yeah. All right, do me a favor. Get in your starting position right behind your walls. Good luck, orange team. Good luck, green team. Audience will be cheering you on and helping you out. Ready, set, go find a phone. That is a cup of 40 fish points. That is correct. Go find an umbrella. Yeah, umbrella. Yeah, yeah, yeah. umbrella. Meanwhile, Johnny Three yeah. with the first bowl. Yeah. 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 Well, that is correct. Go find a cup, Lexi. Here comes Mom with an umbrella. That is correct. Go find a screwdriver. Delaney, a screwdriver. Meanwhile, you're looking for a cup over here, Lexi. Looking for a cup. A screwdriver over here trying to add. She's bringing it up for another 40 fish points. That is correct. Amanda, a bell pepper. Meanwhile, you're looking for a cup over here, Lexi. Looking for a cup. Amanda, looking for a bell pepper. Let's go. Let's go. That is correct. You need to go find an umbrella. Go find an umbrella. All right. Yes, we're looking for a bell pepper over here. A bell pepper over here. 
I can only give you credit for two blocks. You guys now have a total of 290 fish points. Orange team, you found all five. You found the finish line flag. You guys are in the lead with 455 fish points. And when we come back, we're going to hook all these guys up together. Yeah, it's going to be a little three, four, one. that families love to play, and we've got a great game going on. Orange team in the lead with 455 fish points. But hey, keep your heads up, green team. You're right there with 290 fish points. So since you're all harnessed in, it can only mean one thing. It's time for three for one. Here's how it works. I'm gonna give you guys a category. Somewhere in our three for one arena is a picture of an item that would fit into that category. When I say go, you must find it, grab it, and waddle your way over to that bin. Drop it in that bin, I will give you your next category. <laughs> Remember, you must alternate turns and you must work as a team to get the job done. You've got 60 seconds to find as many items as you can. We will give you 50 fish points for the first one you find. 60 for the second. Do you know how many for the third? 70. Yeah, so on and so forth. But here's the key. The team with the most fish points at the end of this round will be playing for that grand prize. So, Orange team, you guys are in the lead, so we're going to send you backstage. Go ahead, Orange team. Green team, you're going first. You must find at least three items out there in order to take the lead. All right, but you got 60 seconds. Find as many as you can. The audience will be cheering you on. Good luck, green team. Ready, set, go find a person wearing a hat. This one's for Johnny, a person wearing a hat. That would be Johnny Three, not Johnny Two. He's got the golfer. That is correct. Drop it in there for 50 fish points. Go find something that rings. Lexi, something that rings. This is for 60 fish points. Lexi pulling the whole bit oh, over to the side. Oh, oh, yeah. see how quickly she went for the mobile ball. Yeah. Lightning's off the hook. That is correct. Go find a person with skinny legs, Dad. A person with skinny legs. This right is there. For the lead. Person with skinny legs. Here comes the crab. No, it's got to be a person. It's got to be a person. you got to return that. It's got to be a person with skinny legs. It's got to be a person with skinny legs. Here comes right skinny legs. That is correct for the lead. Go find something that goes on a stove top. Johnny Three. Something that goes on a stove top. Something that goes on a stove top. Oh, you oh, tried to make it over with the portobello mushroom. That goes in something that goes on a stove top. But we were looking for something that goes on a stove top. We could put a frying pan right here. But guess what? Green team, you've taken the lead. Great job, green team. Stand by while we bring out the orange team. <laughs> Welcome back, the orange team. All right, so, orange team, let me give you the cold hard facts. The green team has taken the lead, but you only have to find one item. So, you've got 60 seconds on the clock. You find this one item, and you guys are moving to the grand prize round. So, here we go. <laughs> Audience, cheer them on. 60 seconds on the clock. Ford Delaney, ready, set, go find a person wearing a hat. A person wearing a hat with this is for the win. A person wearing a hat. What do we got? Senior Sam. That's one of my favorite hats out there. Make your way over. Make your way over. Guess what? You win! Oh, Senior Sam! Give it up for the orange team! Out here, guys. Keep it going for the green team. You guys played an awesome game. They're sending you home with some really cool prizes. Orange team, when we come back, you guys get to play the Penguin Prize Hunt to see if you win the grand prize. It all happens next on Picture Eagle.
Welcome back to Picturica, the find it fast, find it first game that everyone loves to play. We're having fun. We're just dancing, having a good old time. Give it up for your orange team, your big winners today. Yeah. You guys have made it all the way to the end of the game. Mom came out with scissors in the beginning, and you've made it all the way here. Now, you're playing for that grand prize. Hey, G, tell this orange team again, what is that grand prize? The grand prize is a trip to Monterey Bay. You got it, G. The acclaimed Monterey Bay Aquarium features over 550 different species, including sea otters, turtles, penguins, sharks, birds, reptiles, and, of course, fish. Stay at the Portola Hotel and Spa just steps away from the historic Fisherman's Wharf and the Monterey Bay. All right, well, we want to send you on that trip, but there's one thing standing in your way, and that is the penguin prize hunt. Here's how we play it. I'm going to show you a grid that has nine pictures of penguins in it. They'll all be wearing something different, just like this one. Study it carefully, because I will take it away after 10 seconds. In our maze, we've got tons of penguins wearing all different kinds of outfits, including the nine that match the ones on our grid. So when I say go, you must race into the maze relay style, find those penguins, grab them, bring them out here one at a time, and place them in the correct location in your grid. You will have 90 seconds to place as many penguins as you can. Now, if there's a moment when you get really nervous, really confused, forget what you're looking for, that's okay. You've got this right here, your new BFF timeout button. You just run up here, hit the button, scream timeout. We will stop the clock and give you a 10-second peek at the correct grid. But you only have one timeout, so use it carefully. <laughs> Place as many penguins as you can into the grid because hidden behind one of these squares is that grand prize to Monterey Bay. Sounds good? You guys ready? All right. Good luck, Orange Team. Do me a favor. Take a look at the screen because your penguin prize hunt starts now. Ninety seconds on the clock. Good luck, Orange Team. Delaney, you're going into the maze first. Ready, set, go find penguins. Go, go, go. Go ahead and tag Amanda. Yes. There you go. Here comes Amanda. Go tag mom. Tag mom. Go, go, go. Tag mom. Wow, you guys do a great while. That was quick, mom. One minute left. 60 seconds. Go, go, go. I'm really good fact, can I do it? I can't. I can mind who. Go ahead and tag Amanda. Yeah. Mom's turn. No. 33 seconds. Yeah. Seconds left. Come on, Mom! Press the press the line, press the line. Okay, we'll take the time out. Here's your 10-second peek at the correct grid. Okay, so mom, you actually hit the timeout before you place this one up here, so I have to give this back to you. It's still your turn. You have to place that again, okay, when we start. You've got 24 seconds left, you guys. Ready, set, go find penguins. Delaney, you're back in there. here, Mom. You guys did awesome. They placed eight penguins into the grid. So, let's find out how many of these penguins are correct. All eight penguins are correct. So, you just don't want that prize to be here at number three. But, let's go to something that happened. You guys hit the timeout button. And then after the timeout, Mom, you placed yours back in one. But then, Delaney, before you went back into the maze, you actually made a change, right? You took 
what was in number eight and moved it to number seven. Yeah. You studied it and you moved it over there. So why don't we start with that one? That was the one you moved. That's the correction you made. So we'll start down here. Is the grand prize here behind number seven?